Hello everyone. Let's start with new module windowing and clipping. In this we will learn basic concept of windowing and clipping. Windowing. A scene is made up of collection of objects specified in a world coordinates. A scene with world coordinates. When we display a scene only those objects within a particular window are displayed so we draw a imaginary boundary is like a window that is a rectangular window it's having two boundaries one is minimum another is maximum so in x coordinate we will find that wx minimum and wx maximum those are boundary and wy minimum and wy maximum those are boundary on y coordinates so we display that rectangle in this minimum maximum values so in particular window we select a particular region of points or a scene which is need to be considered or which is need to be displayed or which is need to be retained within the window window in 3 because drawing things to display takes time we clip everything outside the window so clipping will be done outside the window and inside the window the geometry is retained outside the window the geometry is clipped that means it is removed clipping it is used to extracting a part of a scene and for identifying visible surfaces in displaying multi window environments selection of object that can be applied with necessary geometric transformations zooming and panning of image is applied on necessary geometry for the image below consider which lines or points that sh should be kept which one should be clipped so there are multiple lines are there and within the window those are retained outside the window the points and lines are clipped point clipping easy a point xy is not kept if wx minimum is less than or equal to x is less than or equal to wx max similarly wy minimum less than or equal to y less than or equal to wy maximum otherwise it is clipped so the points p7 p10 p2 p8 p4 those are clipped points while p1 p9 p5 the points within the window are retained those are not clipped line clipping harder examining the end points of each line to see if they are in the window or not situation first situation is both the end points inside the window don't required clip that means those lines inside the window are already retained second situation one end point inside the window and one outside so that time we must clip because inside the window clip retention will be done but outside the window those points are outside the window those need to be clipped third situation both end points outside the window that time solution is don't know because we don't know whether we need to clip or whether we need to retain those points inside the window or not so we don't know brute force line clipping 
this is one of the method brute force line clipping can be performed as follows don't clip the lines with both end points within a window okay so here you observe the red points or red lines so that will suggest the first point for lines one end point inside the window and one end point outside calculate the intersection point we have to calculate intersection point on that window using the equation of line and clip from that point to out that means we observe that window we got intersection points and from that intersection point to the outside of the window we need to be clipped for lines with both end points outside the window test the line for intersection with all the window boundaries and clip appropriately so in this case also some of the lines are outside the window those are should be clipped then there are intersection points that should be calculated for those lines and that is computationally expensive which is cut the window points okay so we need to be calculated those in intersection points because the scene can contain so many lines the brute force approach to clipping is much too slow if lines are more it must be slower to operate in case of intersection we use line equation that is x is equal to x1 plus u into x2 minus x1 and y is equal to y1 plus u into y2 minus y1 where u is a one of the parameter it always lies between 0 to 1 if u for an intersection with clipping boundaries is within 0 and 1 then the line is not inside the clipping rectangle if between 0 and 1 then line is inside the clipping rectangle this method is to be applied to each of the edges of clipping rectangle to identify the position of lines thank you hope you understand the concept of windowing and clipping